Uh, my name is Don Cameron. Uh, I live here uh, in uh, the Forest Hill area. Uh, lived on uh, Rawl Green Crescent for some time. It was an infamous street at one time when one of the houses blew up, but uh, that all cleared up and uh, son of a gun, our taxes went back up. <laughs> I'm actually from Prince Edward Island. Uh, that's where I was born and brought up. I left the island when I was 21. I went to St. Catharines to work in radio there after I had started my broadcasting career in uh, Summerside. And then in a short uh, period after St. Catharines, I moved to Kitchener. And uh, then the Kitchener Rangers came to town in 1963. So uh, I, was just, I have been associated with them since then now. That uh, takes you into about 52 years. I have been doing the games for at least uh, 45 years plus and hoping to still do it for a little while longer. My wife got me involved in this because she used to be a bridge player, but uh, health issues have such that uh, she doesn't play anymore. But you know, I think it's about 15 years, maybe a little bit longer. To me, it's not a big deal. Uh, it's, uh, you know, there are times when I said, say to your wife, what have you got me into, you know, but uh, it, no, it was, uh, it was a, a way to help out and, and it, it's good for them because they arrive to play bridge and they walk in the room and the tables and chairs are set up. They can sit down and really get at it. I come uh, full of energy, I hope. It's one day a week I come up, it probably takes me 25 minutes at the most. If I want to slow down and uh, just do it slowly, it's probably 30 minutes. I come back in the afternoon, uh, maybe around 3.15 or 3.30 when they're finishing off. It's, it's just, a, I think, a little thing that, that I hope makes their day go a little bit better. Uh, I uh, like the silence or the sounds of setting up the table, and I like to think about things, whether, uh, whether in my mind I'm thinking about the hockey match that's coming up on Friday night, where I'm getting prepared for that uh, mentally and, and physically, that I have to do this before the game, I have to get this ready before the game, and then the game comes. And so you use a, a situation such as here at the, at the center to uh, kind of just refresh your mind, get it going in the right direction, and think of other things too. What else do I have to do today? What bills do I have to pay? What are my plans ahead? Uh, you know, how's the family back home? And, and this kind of thing. And uh, uh, I, I just find it so much better that uh, I'm with myself and doing my thinking on uh, projects and other things that uh, I should be doing in the very near future. When you first come up and you first do it the first few times, I think it's, uh, it's like anything. Uh, you, uh, you walk in and you do your thing and you nod to the people at the desk and the next time around you kind of wave to them at the desk. And in time you, uh, you make more connections. They have found the right people to, to work in these places and they seem to encourage the young, old, and in-between to use these centers. It's always been that way. Uh, there's been the community centers, there's been the churches, there's been the schools. This is where people have always gathered to uh, do something. It's probably the best way of socializing, and yet at the same time, uh, uh, you can do something as simple as setting up these tables. Thanks again. You're welcome. Anytime. All right. Bye for now. Bye.